This is why I hate walking in the forest by myself. I tend to get lost all the time, but it looks like someone could be in that house to help me out. Ah, finally, it's so dark, I just wanna get inside and get from outside. I'm just hoping someone is home that can at least help me here. All right, wish me luck, you guys. I'm gonna ring the door and see if anyone's there. Hello? Hello? Oh my! Oh my goodness! What in the world is this? Is this some kind of armor stand jump scare here? No way. Wow. <laughs> All right, what's going on guys? My name's Anthony, or Big B Stats, and if you're wondering who's responsible for giving me, or you, a heart attack, it's gonna be this guy here, UKX Tasker, a good friend of mine, who is going to, me and him are gonna be teaching you guys how to make this armor stand jump scare in the brand new update, uh, title update 31. It's quite cool. All you'll need is a block, packed ice, redstone, redstone repeater, uh, you'll need an armor stand, piston, and a slime block, uh, and then you also need a stair of your choice as well, which I'll eventually get that uh, too. So it's very easy and very easy, <laughs> easy, very easy and very basic. All you want to do is place uh, the packed ice here. Uh, he's walking me through this basic easy tutorial, so you guys can do it as well. So let's go ahead and get some steps here. So you place your packed ice again. You can make this however you like. Then you want to place the stair in front of it. Now what you want to do is you want to place blocks all around it. So uh, not on top, but all around. So we'll go like, uh, let's see, three three out. And so we'll do one on the extra back. So we place it around and we do one more in the back there. So there you have it. So it should be two after the packed ice and three on the sides of that. Now you put one redstone piece uh, right there beside the, re uh, the, the packed ice. Then you put a redstone repeater facing the other way. So make sure you're facing this way when you place it. You place a block there, then you place redstone on that block. Now you will need another block, which you're gonna place there, and then you're gonna need a piston. He's using a sticky piston, but you can also use a regular piston uh, as well. So we'll place a piston facing the packed ice, just like that. Now all you need to do is uh, add a slime block to that because this is going to allow the armor stand to kind of bounce out. Now what you need to do is have an armor stand there. You can also dress it up however you like. Now you also need to cover this up as like a doorway. Keep in mind you can use any block you like. It does not have to be quartz. We just chose to use quartz. He loves quartz and I love quartz. So that's why we're using that but you can use any block you like. Now you'll need a button. Now this is a very important part too, because this is kind of like the bell. You can use a lever if you want to, but you wanna put the button right on the block that is like right behind the redstone. So we'll put that there. As you can see, it's just like this. And remember, you can dress up your armor stand however you like, as creepy as you like. If you wanna dress it up in, I don't know, a zombie outfit or maybe dye some wool uh, for the armor and dress it up like that, you can. I'm just gonna use like Steve, so this could possibly be like a kind of a Herobrine kind of a thing here. So we'll just dress up this little Steve character here. Uh, and there you have it. That's pretty much it. It's very basic and very easy. I'll show you guys little things you can do here and there. He typically likes to use ice, so when the, whenever the armor stand kind of pops out, it kind of slides a little bit faster. And you also want to place a door right there on the ice. So yeah, he tends to use ice uh, as far as like on the doorway. I'm going to use slime blocks. That's how I'm going to show you because I feel like this one, in my opinion, is just very cool the way it kind of like bounces out at you. It's almost like a, a really cool jump scare here. So we'll place uh, some slime blocks there uh, and I'm going to place some carpet so you can cover that up. So again, you can make it as discreet and secret as you like uh, so no one will ever know. And you can also, you know, maybe make this in a house or something like that to where it's like you have your armor popping out. He has ice. I have slime blocks. So you'll see the difference. You see his kind of like slides out. Uh, that, that was really cool. That's very scary. It almost got me there, buddy. And this one kind of like bounces out here. So we press that, boom, and it kind of bounces. But yeah, that's pretty much it for today's tutorial on the armor stand jump scare. I hope you guys did enjoy. Uh, feel free to check out Tasker's uh, channel down below in the description. And I would also like to thank you guys for watching. And remember to subscribe if you like to see more tutorials and such things like this. And until the next, I will talk to you guys later. Peace out. Bye.